PVWT2 O hand held welding gun. Replace the collimating lens. Explain the replacement of collimating lenses. When replacing the lens, it needs to be replaced in a most free workshop. There is no dust free workshop, so the replacement can be done in a relatively clean office. First, Remove the collimator assembly. You need to remove the screws on both sides of the gun, one on each side. After removing the two screws, you can unscrew the calibration component. After unscrewing it, seal it with tape to prevent dust from entering the cavity. The collimation assembly also needs to be sealed. Then unscrew the two screws in the middle of the calibration component. You can unscrew the calibration component. It should be noted that when replacing the lens, you need to wear dust-free finger gloves. If you don't have them, avoid touching the mirror with your fingers. Unscrew the calibration component and seal it with tape. Then unscrew the gasket that fixes the lens. After unscrewing, remove the gasket that fixes the lens. Then take out the large spacer and the old lens. There's a small gasket at the bottom. Put in a small gasket first and adjust the position with a cotton swab. Then take out the new lens. When you take out a new lens, check it for dust or fingerprints. If there is dust or fingerprints, wipe it clean with a cotton swab dipped in alcohol. The collimating lens has no orientation, so it can be placed directly into the assembly. Use a cotton swab to adjust the lens position. Put in a large gasket and use a cotton swab to adjust the position. Finally, put in the spacer that fixes the lens. Then tighten the spacer that fixes the lens. Then you can tighten the calibration component again. Then tighten the two screws in the middle of the calibration component. After tightening, you can install the support assembly back into the gun body. Installing the calibration component, tighten the screws on both sides of the gun handle. The calibration lens replacement is complete. Thank you for watching.